The head of many of America's big tech companies were at the White House on Tuesday. They want urgent reform of the spy agency, the NSA, and its data gathering operation. It looks like they may get their wish and a lot quicker than expected. A surveillance review board report was due to be published early next year, but it's now been pushed out by the White House. It makes more than 40 recommendations. The highlights, the NSA will no longer keep a phone database. It'll be held by the phone companies or a third party. The agency can no longer ask companies to build a backdoor in their software, which allows the government access to encrypted information. And the NSA should not spy on non-US citizens outside of the US because of their religion or their political views. The scope of the NSA surveillance program was revealed by whistleblower Edward Snowden. The journalist who helped him get the information out says any changes need strong support. The congressional committees that oversee the intelligence community are completely co-opted. They're worthless and impotent when it comes to restraining the NSA, even if they had the incentive to do so, which they don't. Courts have been very one-sided, and so I think we need genuine oversight mechanisms beyond the ones we have to ensure that these changes actually take place if the White House ends up adopting them. The White House can accept, reject or modify the panel's recommendations, but it will also have to consider a recent decision by a federal judge who ruled that the massive collection of data may be unconstitutional. The intelligence community won't be happy. It'll argue any changes will restrict efforts to listen in or monitor conversations of alleged terrorists, rogue states or others they feel need to be watched. Uh, Any time there are outside elements, be they judicial or legislative or the fifth estate, you know, the media, uh, the journalism, uh, that is uh, passing judgment by shedding light on clandestine programs, it becomes a problem for the national security establishment. That's not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, oversight is important and uh, unchecked and unwatched uh, institutions as people will creep and expand their their actions so th- so these things need to occur but it's not pleasant the panel does not suggest the NSA stop seizing all phone and internet data and that was never likely to happen but it does recommend reducing the scope of what it can grab Alan Fisher Al Jazeera Washington